Hey, what is up heroes and welcome to Pokemon Mythic Legends, another ROM hack that has been completed by the Hacks Repairman who's just gone around finishing all these old hacks and this one looks really cool. I think your starter Pokemon is going to be either Entei, Suicune or Raikou. Don't know too much about the story because I kind of want to go in blind but the fact that one of these is going to be a starter is going to be an epic adventure so let's jump right into it. Okay, so got the controls which uh, we, we know how to play the game. So you are something special. Ooh, thank you. I can feel it all around you. You have a great destiny ahead of you. Be sure to take the right path. What is the right path, you ask? That is something for you to decide on your own, all in due time. New paths will open to you by helping people in need, overcoming challenges, and solving mysteries. At times, you'll be challenged by others and attacked by wild creatures. Be brave and keep pushing on. You'll be confused at first, helpless even. But in due time, all the pieces of the puzzle will come together and form your destiny. I await you in the place that matters most. Don't wait. Ooh. Alright, that's got me pretty hyped, man. It's been pretty hyped. Hello there. Glad to meet you. Glad to meet you too. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Oak. People affectionately refer to me as the Pokemon Professor. Good. This world is inhabited far and wide by creatures called Pokemon. For some people, what Pokemon are pets, others use them for battling. As for myself, I study Pokemon as a profession. All good. But first, tell me a little bit about yourself. Has it got custom sprites? Uh, I don't know yet. I guess we'll wait and see when we get inside the game. But oh, it does. Sweet, dude. Actually, looks pretty good. Alright, let's put our name in. Voltsy. There we go. Right, so your name is Voltsy. Yes, it is. Very good. And this is my grandson. He's been your rival since you both were babies. Uh, have you got a new sprite? You don't. Okay, I'll just, uh, I'll just go with Gary, for the sake of it. Uh, was it Gary? Yes it was. That's right, I remember now his name is Gary. Folksy, your very own Pokemon Legends is about to unfold, and what a dreams and adventures of Pokemon awaits. Let's go! Oh, let's go indeed. Ooh! Okay. Starting out in a creepy little place in the rain, like a mansion here. Should we go in here? Whoa, where the heck am I? Alright, this must be some weird dream, so I guess I'll see where this dream goes. Yep, let's just walk into a strange, creepy mansion. Oh. Okie dokie. Oh, this dream gets stranger by the second. Let me quickly as well put the tech speed to fast. Uh, nice little frames. Let's put green. That'll do. Oh. Hi. Whoa, who are you? I brought you here to request your help. Oh, what do you need me to do? That depends. Will you accept a changed destiny and help others? Will you accept a new destiny and protect others? Uh... Yeah? Sure, I'll play along. Good trainer, follow me. Okie dokie. This is- Oh! Hello! So we've got the three legendary beasts. Sitting here are the offspring of Raikou, Entei, and Suicune. My request is that you pick one of the offspring that is most like you, and keep it from being used by evil forces who might abuse it. Whoa, these Pokemon look uh, look cool. I definitely accept. That's the response I'd been hoping for. Your new partner awaits. So who should we take? It's a really hard choice, like Entei, Suicune, or Raikou. Um, I I think I'm gonna go with Suicune. I think I'd, I don't know. Actually, I really like Raikou. I like all three. Uh, I am gonna go with Suicune, Lord of the Purifying Waters, Suicune, yeah, let's go with that. Nice, so interesting choice, trainer. Voltsy chose to protect Suicune. Okay, oh, what? okay, just paid back up, but um, I see you've chosen, trainer. Be sure to keep the Pokemon safe and become friends with it. Farewell. The mysterious character hypnotizes you into sleeping. And so your journey begins, trainer. It will contain many surprises, and evil lurks forth. But be brave. Your journey starts now. Oh, cool. Do we actually have Suicune on our team? Uh, we do. Level 5. So what you got? Bite, Water Gun, and Quick Attack. Alright, level 5 Suicune. Evo, we're going to be super OP. And we are going to destroy everyone. Or the creators of the game potentially nerfed the legendary beast to make him a bit, you know, 
kind of average, but Pokemon and Mythic Legends created by Psychic Boy. Enjoyed the game so far. Who said that? Who the heck is Psychic Boy? <laughs> Alright, I'll try and enjoy it, my dude. Hopefully it's good. <sighs> What's up, Dad? Oh, nothing, Foxy. It's just Professor... Misuki? Misuke, I have no idea. Asked me to tell you to come and see her. What's wrong with that? Nothing, it just means you're finally leaving. It's okay, Dad. I'll visit. Really? That's all I wanted to hear. I think you better hurry to Masuke's. Okie dokie. Alright. It kind of feels like when we're walking forward, or even sideways, kind of like bobbing a little bit. <laughs> Got no running shoes yet, but uh, yo. Jeez. Gotta wonder uh, whose idea it was to build a town inside of a cave. Or in a cave? Oh, okay. Uh, yo, what's up? Oh, Uno out! Uh, dang it! <laughs> How'd you always beat me? I'm really good at this game. Alright, let's go again. This time if you win, I'll give you five Poké Dollars. Or so. Oh, okay. <laughs> so playing Uno. I haven't played Uno in so long. I used to love it on the, um, the 360. There was like an Uno game. So fun. Where is the, uh, the lab? Oh, it's gonna be down here. What's up? Hey, you just moved here, right? What's your name? Faulty, huh? Cool name. Hey, thank you. I would think so too. Uh, what's up? Hey, you ever hear the phrase, the early bird gets the worm? Uh, no. Just wondering, because it seems uh, Misuki's given away all the starters. What? Just go inside. I guess we don't um, get any starter from her, because we've got Suikun, obviously. No. Ah, <sighs> you're late. Uh, I had a dream and never slept. Well, that's a shame. All the starter Pokemon were taken while you were dreaming. No, that's impossible. I'm sorry, Voltsy, but the rule states it's impossible for someone to become a trainer without at least one Pokemon. You have to come back next season. Why? It's just not fair. All that wait. Oh. Why, wow, that's the legendary Pokemon Suicune. I never thought I'd live long enough to see this Pokemon. Hey, he's so young and curious too. Suicune gently nudges an item on your belt. After close inspection, it appears to be some kind of Pokeball. What the? When did this get here? Uh, Suicune, return? Truly remarkable. Well, Voltsy, it looks like you have your Pokemon. Lucky for you, I have another Pokedex to spare. Hey, sweet. I'll just change this. Press that. There, yeah, all done. It's now registered to Voltsy. Here you go, Voltsy. You're now an official trainer. Thank you, Professor. I can't believe I'm finally your trainer. You've come a long way, Voltsy. Now run along. Gary's already way ahead. Oh yes, before you start your journey, go visit your father. He has something to give you. Hopefully it's the, uh, the running shoes. That would be really nice. <laughs> Alright, uh, there's also a house I want to quickly go check out here. Just in case we get free stuff, because free stuff is best stuff. Ooh. Gary's already gone, you better hurry if you want to catch up. Can I have the town map? Uh, I guess not. Right, let me quickly just uh, speed up a little bit so we can get to the house and hopefully give us the running shoes. Well, Voltsy, I know you're grown up now, but I'm only 10. Yep, grown up. Now, as a going away present, I'd like to give you my lucky running shoes. Your lucky running shoes? Yep, I had them uh, since I started my adventure. Uh, thanks, Dad? No problem, Voltsy. Now go and start your adventure. Okay, see you later, Dad. <laughs> they grow up so fast. <laughs> so, we can run! Now we've spoken to our dad, I'm gonna quickly speak to uh, our rival's sister again. Maybe we can get into the town map? No, we can't. Man, that map would have been useful. I guess we go this way? So a guy blocking the cave, yep. So Rovandria Tunnel? Alrighty. But hopefully going through here there'll be lots of like Zubats and uh, Geodudes we can take out. Get lots of XP for our Suicune. We will see. Sandshrew, nice. It's what a gun that bad boy level 4. So far picking Suicune, going through this cave is definitely the best, because uh yeah, it's gonna be easy. Oh, and nothing up there, so let's go up the ladder. Going one level so far. Not bad, not bad. Lots of encounters, but hey, XP's XP, you know? Alright, route one. I love the graphic style. Like, I don't know, just the shade of green looks really nice, but uh, whoa. Is it hard living in a cave? Uh, not really. It's actually kind of interesting. <laughs> Alright. Oh, there's an item down there, Meowth. Uh, I just bite that bad boy. And we got X attack. Nice. And Nidoran, just gonna water gun ya. 
And water gun again, and water gun, third time. And yo, what's up? You have a strange aura about you. Let me confirm my suspicions. Oh, please have ghost types, so I can bite them bad, but all psychic types even better. And you put me to sleep. You level 9? I mean, to be fair, I do have a legendary Pokemon, so it's not it's not too bad. I got a flinch. Sweet. But level 9, that was kind of scary. Oh, what's this? The challenge of the elements. One day I'll take this challenge and become a great trainer. The tallest building in the region of Apollo. So that's the region's name. Uh... But I can't let you take the element tower challenge until you have all eight battles. Okay, so this is the... I guess the Elite Four, pretty much. It's good to know. Get healed up here though, at least. It's kind of crazy the Elite Four is at Route 1. <laughs> uh, I don't want to bite you just in case I get poison pointed. That would be bad. But Clarity Town. Oh, hi. Oh, I guess Gary has got a custom sprite, but hey, Voltsy, it took you so long to get here. I've been waiting here the entire time to see what starter you got. Uh, about that. You don't need to tell me. A lot of battling skills talk. Oh, dude, you're about to get absolutely destroyed. Ooh. Looks kind of cool. Got Charmander. <laughs> Go, Charmander! Go, Suicune! Do not stand a chance, dude. Let's water gun that bad boy. Nice damage. And one more water gun. Nice. <laughs> well, Voltsy, you're pretty good. Hey, thanks. I try. I try. Wow. Voltsy, you're a natural at battling. Next time, I won't be so soft, though. See ya. I'm gonna get my first badge. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so. Uh, let's go explore the town. This town is famous for its crystal clear waters. Oh, nice. Uh, yo, what's up? Dude. Dude? One day I'll turn 10 and start my adventure like you. Somehow that seems really... Something, just don't get... Don't hurt yourself. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> All right, what else can we find in this town? See, I'm not sure how far this um, this game went before Hacks Repairman came and fixed it. Well, I say fixed it, like finished it. But I uh, I think it went up to beta free, so I'm assuming it had quite a bit of content before, you know, it got finished. But man, Hacks Repairman is an absolute legend. Just like coming in and find all these like cool ROM hacks and just finishing them up. Like I'm just still so happy he finished Sienna. Because like Sienna was just was a really good hack and just it never got finished and now it is but in the anime Pokemon centers are much larger than this well that is strange <laughs> I kind of like the dialogue with the uh, the the NPCs it's kind of funny and your support man please feel free to use that PC in the corner okay obviously I will is there a gym in this town or is it just uh it's the first town and it's just like you know just people to talk to the next town is a pretty huge library have you been there uh I have not not yet Wait, have I been in that house? Uh, hey kid, I noticed you don't have a rod. Nope, I don't fish much anyway. Nonsense, here, take my old one. Oh, thanks. Not that I really want it, but oh, there's a lot of. Oh, okay, you want a battle? I'm fine with that, actually. All that XP for me. So we're probably going to need to uh, grind up. Just from the start of the game already, it does seem like it's going to be a little bit difficult with the levels. However, that might be because, obviously, we have a Suicune. <laughs> you know? Could be very easy. Just fight all these Magikarps. Eat them all up. Just imagine you're fighting like a new trainer. You're like a, uh, a Suicune, dude. Just don't stand a chance. I better go heal up again. I should get the PP back because I have no PP. But that was worth it. And there's no more buildings to go in, I don't think. Yeah, I've been around here. And if it's the right, nope. Right, so we'll get healed up and then we'll go to the next town. And also check if I can check the town map on the board here, because if I can, kind of get a sense of where we're going. Oh, so here's the region, okay. So it's quite a straightforward region, just like follow the path, follow the path, which I don't actually mind. So we are going to head to Vesteria City. Okay. Sounds good, let's go. Let's go, so let's just head west. Uh, Hi. The forest ahead has a large variety of Pokemon. Should stock them on Pokeballs. I have some, right? Because of the professor. Five. And that, that should be enough. Wait, what's up here? Uh, what's up? 
I can't, uh, I come up here to rest. That forest was really tiring. Well, we'll see about that. Might be tiring for you, but I have a legendary. I'm still for a Suicune, love. I ain't gonna get tired that easy. Uh, so, lots of trainers get lost in this uh, forest, so be prepared for lots of battles. Great, annoying random battles. <laughs> Won't be too bad if we're, uh, getting all that XP. Level 13? Dude, the levels jump so high. Level 10, that's a bit better. Like I said, it's probably not that bad because we're a legendary, but still. Just gonna grab the item. Fight that Caterpie. Super Potion, oh, Super Potion, not bad. And I'm actually gonna quickly... Rain Dance, nice. Gonna use this potion now. Well, normal potion. Stay a little bit healthy. Go, Bug Squad, go! Oh, Bug Squad, eh? No match for my bites. What do you got for a water gun? I get some Butterfree, yep. Easy peasy. Nice, I thought I was gonna hurt myself for a second then. We're level 13 already. Uh, which way do we wanna go? Just guess follow the path. Should probably maybe capture another Pokemon as well, but. Level 15, ooh, okay. This is bad, this is bad. Can go for one more attack. I should go for another one. Ooh, that was close. That was close, that was close, that was close. Yeah. Probably should maybe find another Pokemon, but I don't know what I want. And I don't know what we can find in the grass here. Like, I don't want a Wurmple. What else can we get? Weedle. No thanks. I think it's going to be bug types, and I don't want bugs. Really don't want bugs. Uh, yo, what's up? I like raising cute Pokemon, eh? That's pretty cute, to be fair. But I don't want to bite you just in case you have static. I don't fancy getting paralyzed. I really don't. Thank you very much. If I, if I find a Pikachu, I don't mind capturing that. That'd be pretty good. I'm looking for a rare Pokemon from for Professor Musuke. Okay. If you're looking for rare Pokemon, maybe you can find the starters in here. Now that would be kind of cool. Probably like a high rarity. I would assume if he's looking for Pokemon for her. Maybe. But also could be looking for anything else. And there's an item there. Let me grab that. We should get level 15. Nope. So close. So close. Can we get through there? Oh, we can. And it leaves no arm. Oh, and this would be a good spot to like put a hidden item or something. Anyway, let's go back around. Just worried I'm gonna run out of PP very soon. Have you seen my brother yet? Uh, I don't think so. We are just getting so many levels so quick. Ooh, draw. Okay, uh, quick attack. Good. Dude, you random trainers do not stand a chance against me, honestly. Why even bother? Yo, my teacher asked me to come here and study the habitats of Pokemon. Oh, oh, you got Vulpix? If I find a Vulpix, I would definitely capture one. Question is, does the Pokedex actually work in this game? Uh, let's find out. So, Vulpix. It does not. Big sad. Big sad. But it's fine though, it's fine. Uh, Spinarak now. Time to use an Aria Dos for a second then. Let's just keep quick attacking. You can lower my speed all you want, doesn't matter. Oh, a critical hit. Let's go. Dude, Suicune is just so, so OP. <laughs> oh man, you love to see it. Although this Dust Tox is doing, oh, doing work. Okay, that was lucky we got through the confusion then. Otherwise, that would have been so bad. That would have been so bad. I'm just gonna run away for a little bit because I don't want to waste my PP. I'm gonna have to save for, for more battles. I'm hoping we're nearly out. Yes, so we can go get healed up. Oh, wow, you made it out of the forest alive? I did. Well, yeah, I guess. Good job, kid. Thanks. For performing this feat, I'm supposed to give you this. HM, oh. Wow, thanks, smiley face. <laughs> Not so unenthusiastic now, are you? <laughs> and we got cut. Nice. Thanks, buddy. Uh, I've scaled mountains, splunked caves, and climbed all the way to the top of Mount Silver. So why was it so hard for me to get through that forest? Wow, Mount Silver? I'm getting old. <laughs> Alright, uh, oh. Uh, I'm gonna come back here in a second. I wanna get healed up first just in case, like, we run into, like, a battle or something. So there's a lot to explore in this town, which is good. Lots to explore, hopefully lots of free stuff. Can't leave the city because some trees are in the way and none of my Pokemon no cut. Ooh, sucks to be you, dude. Dude, do you have a heart? Do you have heart gold or soul silver? 
I'm AF Gamer, man, I'm so glad I- wait. What? I'm so glad I sold silver. Can I touch it? Not your lifetime, dude. Man, I'm so glad I bought soul silver. Can I touch it? Wait. Oh, okay. I thought for a, for a split second I was gonna be like an infinite loop. Okay, same, say, same, uh, say the same thing. But, um, yeah. So I'm guessing this. Wait, what? Oh, I'm guessing this game probably released roughly around the same time as uh, Heart Gold Soul Silver, which was what, 2010? 2009? I feel like it was 2009. No, I think it was 2010. It was around there. I remember me and my friends walked to uh, Toys R Us to pick the game up. Rip Toys R Us. Miss that. I still have that original like Soul Silver I picked from um, Toys R Us as well with the Poker Walker. All right, all right, okay. So we go to the library. There's the gym. Are you going to challenge our gym leader? Yep. Good luck. He's pretty tough. Yeah, we're supposed to see about that. Well, not right now. I'm gonna go explore the town and then probably take on the gym leader next episode, maybe? Depends what happens at the, the library. Uh, sure. Ooh, thank you! I mean, I wasn't struggling, but I'll, uh, I'll take this. Nice, nice, nice. Aha! Very good. Free stuff is best stuff, my dude. Free stuff is best stuff! Have you been inside the library yet? Has a, a lot of interesting reads, eh? Go check it out once I've finished exploring. Uh, sup, old man? Give me free stuff. Pokemon can be found almost everywhere. What Pokemon do you have? I have a Suicune, dude. What do you have? Let me tell ya. It ain't beating my Suicune. Right, uh, I've got two houses to go into. Have you heard the library has new Naruto ma manga? Oh, okay. My daughter reads way too much comics for a girl. Hey man, let her read Naruto, Naruto's cool. I actually need to finish Naruto. My goal for the end, but well, before the end of this year is to finish Shippuden. I'm currently at the, um, I'm near the end. Like, um, don't want to spoil it because no one's seen Naruto, but there's like, what, 500 episodes? I think I'm like 430 before I stopped watching like two years ago, but um, where do you think you're going? What? This underground area is a training facility to help all the trainers that may have lost to our gym leader. Here, you can hang with the trainers here and pr practice your skills for a fee, of course. Okay. So I can battle these trainers then, for a bit of experience. How many trainers are there? There's a few. Should we just fight them all real quick? Uh, maybe if I beat Vice, he'll go out with me. Oh. Uh, just got a water gun. That Mystic Water, we've been doing so much damage. The fact that they're losing to Vice and they're level like 16 makes me think we probably need to be around 20. Either way. We're killing it right now, we're killing it. Easy dude. Next. I've beaten our gym leader, but I'm here to mentor these young trainers. Okay. So you beat him with an Eevee. And I guess a load of other Pokemon. Oh, this is bad. I'm gonna rain dance. Oh no. I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose. That's fine. That's fine. That guy was a bit too strong. <laughs> right, let's go to the um, the library. I'll go do some grinding in there, off screen. Go beat them all, do a little bit of grinding ready for the gym leader, because I don't want to be getting wrecked, you know? Uh, yo, what's up? Oh, okay. What's up? Love it here, they always have the nicest books. Oh, I'll see about that. You gotta love free TV. What? Can't afford cable? <laughs> What are you watching? Next show will be Sinnoh now, okay. How to be a ninja, huh, guess I'll check it out. Naruto one, huh? Sounds cool. <laughs> oh, so you're the first one, huh? huh? What are you talking about? Did you have a dream where an old lady gave you a Pokemon? Yeah, how did you know? Because, because I had that same dream too. What, how's that possible? I guess I'll tell you what I know. But first, I need to know something. Battle me. Hey, wait a second. So she's gonna have Raikou or Entei. Please have Entei. Entei, hey! Level 23! Yeah, I am need to do a lot of grinding. The levels in this are pretty uh pretty over the place. I need to do some grinding and burn, that's fine, because one more water gun and we win. Sunny day, oof. It's fine, it's fine. Quick attack. That was actually kinda tough. That was actually really tough. Bubble beam, yes. Goodbye, water gun. Whew. Looks like you were perfect for protecting it. 
Yay! Can't say the same about you though. <laughs> I'm sorry for just attacking you like that. It's just uh, I was told to be careful of who I trusted and I can tell that you're trustworthy. So what's going on? What do we have these Pokemon? This library will explain everything. By the way, I'm Maria. Guess you already know my name. Yes I do. The lady told me. Follow me. Okie dokie. Oh. So, uh, read those books, they will explain almost everything. I'm pretty sure most journeys start like this. What books? Oh, these ones? Guardians, real or fictitious? Okay. Guardians, what are they? Guardians are people with the ability to control legendary Pokemon. For a long time, Guardians were just something of myth. That is, until I noticed something about my son. My son Alex, age 15, was very energetic. He just loved to befriend Pokemon. One day, he asked me to come and see his newest friend. Suffice to say, I was quite shocked and impressed with his friend. His friend was the legendary Pokemon Moltres. I continued to study my son's ability, even witnessing a battle with controlling the Moltres' power easily. From this, I concluded that this ability was a great gift. Pages are torn and you are unable to read the rest. Okie dokie. Next one. Uh, a threat to this world, okay. December, he attacked. Controlling the legendary was, an easy, was as easy as controlling a Magikarp to him. We gave him everything, yet he completely destroyed us. The Pokemon he wielded was an Articuno. Suddenly, out of the blue, there were two boys. They threw their Pokeballs and out came the legendary Pokemon Zapdos and Moltres. The three trainers battled it out. The fight was vicious. Finally, the evil guardian was taken down. When asked who the heroes were, the one partnered uh, with Moltres said his name was Alex. Well, the one with Zapdos said, you can't okay. So I'm guessing me and Maria here are going to be like the heroes, and there's going to be another one with Raikou who's going to be evil. So why are Guardians here? That is a question I ask myself every day. What was our purpose? Why can we control legendaries? I always asked and always got the same answer. The purpose comes within time. Does this mean each one of us takes a different path? I travelled for I travelled far with Moltres to answer this question. Along my travels, I met the legendary trainer Red. There he told me of his travels, and that's when I realised. There was no answer to my question. Each Guardian's path truly is unique. Oh, cool. Alright, I'm good. Uh, yes. Well, that's really all I, that I know. There's a little bit more that I found out about us Guardians, but I'd rather keep it to myself. It's probably not the best thing to do, but okay. Well, I'm gonna, going to well, I'm gonna go on the road. Also, I think there may be another Guardian like us with the third dog Pokemon out there. Just be on the lookout and be careful out there. Hey, the next time we meet, let's battle. Definitely. Sounds good. But I need to get some more Pokemon. <laughs> Can't just be using Suicune, you know? So I need to go and do some grinding. But well, I think this is probably a great part to end this episode off. Next episode, oh, we will uh, go take on the first gym. And I'll be a little bit stronger and I'll probably go back into the forest and see if I can catch any cool Pokemon. Please save the game. I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day. Peace.